Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install RHL 9.4 on VirtualBox. First go to redhat.com. First we will download the RHL. Click on Developers. Then click on Products. Click on Products. Click on Red Hat Enterprise Linux. See here, if you go to here, if you go down here, we have the RHL 9.4. R you want older versions, we see here we have the RHL 8.9 and we have the for RHL 9.4 we have the boot ISO DVD ISO. So we are going to download this DVD ISO. Click on download. Now it will ask us to log into your Red Hat account. So click on register or go back. Right click on this one, click on open link in new tab, then register here scroll down see here we have to fill all the details like if you have an account you have to provide here otherwise create your account and click on create my account then you will receive email for activation then you have to click on it after that you have to come here and you have to provide your email okay click on it provide email and provide the password then sign in download has been started see now it is downloading the dvd see the size is 10.3 gigabytes wait until download completes but i am cancelling this one because i have already downloaded rhl 9.4 dvd iso file so cancel this one in your case wait until download completes once download is completed then open oracle vm virtual box on your machine if you want to install oracle vm virtual box on your machine then go to the link provided in the video description and install it now open oracle vm virtual box Click on new or machine and select new, both are same. So click on new, then provide the name for the virtual machine. I am giving RHL9, then choose the folder to store this virtual machine and file. virtual machine files and folder. So click on other, then select the path where you have the NS space. So I have here, select VMs, create new folder for this one. Then I am giving RHL94 and hit enter, select the folder. Then we have to select the ISO image that which we have downloaded the DVD ISO. Select it from the bottom by clicking on this, by clicking on this drop down button other. Then select the ISO file, click on open. So we have to select the skip unattended installation. So select the checkbox. Then, then only we will be able to select install the manually. Okay, click on next. Here we have to provide the memory. I am giving 4 gigabytes. Based on availability we can give. Number of processors I am giving to click on next hard disk size I am giving that is virtual hard disk size I am giving 100 gigabytes then click on next this is a summary if you want to modify any one of them you have to go back and you have to come forward so click on finish after that also you can click on the settings then we can modify the settings even if you right click on it you can select the settings or right click on it and the machine and select the settings See here we have the settings are simply control S. Okay. See ISO mounted and this is the summary of the virtual machine. Click on start to start to start the installation of RHL 9.4 version on virtual box. So click on start. Use up and down arrows and select the first one that is install and Red Hat Enterprise Linux 9.4. Hit enter. Click on continue. See here now the begin installation has been graved out. So we have to select see we have to select this installation destination and root password. Then only we will be able to click on this begin installation. So select it, hit enter. I'm okay with the default one, then click on done or hit enter. Now use the tab and come to root password and hit enter. Then provide the password for the root user. Use the tab and go to done and hit enter. Click on done. All set. See, now we are able to click on begin installation. So click on it. See, installation has been started. This may take time. I am pausing this video until this installation completes. So 
see installation is completed now we have to click on reboot system hit just select it and hit enter or just click on reboot click on start setup click on next skip this on skip this online accounts then here we have to create the user so i'm giving user full name as artuskus and username also same so user tab and click on next then provide the password of this user see all done so click on start red hat enterprise linux now thanks see now we have to register system to red hat so you have to click on register and provide the username and password so we have successfully downloaded and installed rhl 9.4 on virtual box for more videos please subscribe my channel thank you